All right, so the store has finally closed and I'm gargling down my food, stuffing my face. And as you can see, Kim in the background, slamming the door like there's no tomorrow. She's doing her job while I'm just eating on the clock. And because I'm eating my food, one of my coworkers saw that as you can see right now. <laughs> And now we're just doing janitor duties, you know, cleaning the counter, taking out the trash, going to the back to throw away the trash, getting everything clean for the morning people that are going to be up here for tomorrow. And what are you doing now? Taking out the trash while janitor duties. <laughs> just got, I was eating my little food haul. So today is shuttle day, which basically means that we are getting a lot of TVs and a lot of big other items as well. And I am moving Big Joey to the location and that I need to put up these TVs. I am pushing this machine slowly and gently because if you lose control, then, you know, that's bad news, right? Here is the harness that I'm about to wear soon. And right now I'm just going to get these two TVs onto Joey and yeah it's gonna take a moment short q a time rico story asks are you currently in school since you're doing part-time the last time i went to college was all the way back in 2020 and i dropped out of it because i didn't like going to class i was always late to it and overall i would rather work at a full-time or a part-time job hanging out with my friends rather than just going to school Mr. Rover paid 11 says, how much are you getting at Best Buy? I'm getting paid $17. Some people are getting paid 16. Some others are getting paid 17, 30 or 17, 50. It just depends what position you are and how long you've been with the company. So guys, as you finally see, I got my safety harness on. I usually don't enjoy wearing this, but I kind of have to or else I'll get in trouble and I won't be allowed to be on any machines at all. So there's that. So right now I'm just waiting on the device to hurry up because because the system here is so slow but i finally found a spot to put the tv at so what i'm doing right now is bending them or just putting them away what you usually do first is scan the location and then scan the items and once you do that you just put them items away and that's pretty much it and one of the few things that suck about doing this during the holidays is that we're getting so much tvs we're getting so much tvs to the point where we have to put them on the floor so we can have some space in the back since they're we're gonna get like three trucks a week now and yeah that's not gonna be good for us since it's gonna overflow and overstock here in the back but that's pretty much what i do during shuttle just that all day long due to music playing in the background and copyright i had to mute this song but here's a song that was playing so the aisle that i'm in currently right now at the moment is where the small tvs go they're usually like around the 45 inch mark and this aisle is my favorite aisle to put away tvs because you can easily make room and cram the tvs here and it's pretty much anything that you put here is light daddy chill so i'm currently getting the items that the sales floor people asked us to pull for them and they're putting it back over here because either the customer didn't want them or something else happened so yeah nothing bad all right so i'm almost done with my shift and we're about to close and go home i'm currently doing my last duty which is sweeping i usually sweep here where there's space and i just put the trash in between those spaces like i'm gonna do right now mostly i do this because i just don't want to get or find a sweeper and just throw it in the trash it's much much more easier for me to just do it like this just cram it into like a little small space and honestly it just makes this part of the job way way easier all right for the moment right now i'm doing leftover truck that the guys did on friday it's currently uh sunday morning i was supposed to be doing down stocking but right now i'm just clearing this aisle because i was told to do so which is fine uh it's pretty relaxing i'm just listening to the music here's what i'm listening to the moment and that's pretty much it this is what i will be doing for the rest of the day so i'm taking my sweet time with this and honestly overall it just takes a long long time just to uh get done with this process because 
I need to find space to put on the shelves, which as you can see, there isn't a lot. And there's a lot of stuff on this palette that doesn't belong in this particular section. And so I'm moving that as well. But overall, the process isn't too bad. I'm finishing up a palette right now, as you can see, and moving on to the next palette so I can finish and clear out this entire section because uh, we're going to have truck tomorrow. Well, I'm not going to be working tomorrow, so it doesn't concern me, but might as well do my job, right? How do you feel? I feel very exhausted. I got home from church at like three in the morning. Uh -huh. I ate some steak and shake, but hey, Hell I'm yeah. here, man. Amen. Hey, Amen. And hallelujah, bro. And I'm hey. like, let's hear your best by best, man. Hell yeah. This is what we like to see. A hardworking man. Hardworking Mexican man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Damn. That's how you do it. <laughs> <laughs> Also, I heard the sexiest thing a man can wear is a Best Buy shirt. Is that true? Yeah, true, totally. <laughs>